What's up? I'm Jonah. I play guitar for British band Bring Me The Horizon. You're watching Peter 2. I've been vegan now for almost 13 years. Um, I first went vegetarian when I was about 15 or 16 years old. I tried it out for a few weeks and then I stayed vegetarian for a year and then the next year I, w I decided to go vegan after doing a lot of my own research online and I've been vegan ever since. Honestly, right now I, I technically don't really live anywhere. Um, I spend a lot of time in Sheffield in the UK because of the band, but uh, most of my time is spent living on the tour bus. So, I mean, it's I'm used to traveling around a lot and living out of a suitcase and been touring with the band. So at the moment, that just makes the most sense to keep it that way for me. I have a tattoo on my stomach that says vegan, as you can see. Uh, I got that when I was about 21 years old and I'd been vegan for about four years at the time. Um, I'll probably get more tattoos that express different parts of my personality including you know, my passion for animal rights. When you first go vegetarian and vegan it's a, it's a really big learning experience and you have to be open to trying new things and to also be leaving old things behind. Um, I found for me personally the easiest way to think about things was to not actually think about uh, the products I was boycotting as food but for what they actually were. For instance, you know, the flesh of an animal or the embryo of a chicken. That made it easier for me to give up those products and focus on animal free and cruelty free products such as soy and wheat gluten and all the, all the good stuff. I think for anyone that's going vegan, it, it seems to be really difficult, but the most difficult period is probably about the first six months, and that's the learning and adjusting period. Um, I remember my first six or so months of going vegan, I was constantly checking the ingredients of everything, and you know, you'd find out something that you, you couldn't eat because it had animal products in it, and you might get a bit upset but at the same time you find new products that you didn't even know existed and that's kind of what got me more stoked on the, my new dietary choice. Um, so I think people should remember that it, it feels like it's going to be a really difficult thing and that it's going to be really hard to give up certain things but once you, you get the ball rolling with it and you start to learn what you like and what you don't like and what you can and can't have then it all becomes a lot easier and you get into more of a routine of what kind of foods you enjoy to cook or to go out and eat in restaurants. People should just remember that it's it's a little bit difficult at first but you're doing it for other reasons other than it's not a selfish thing that you're doing so you've got to kind of consider that as well and um, that's what helped me kind of get through that first difficult period and I've never looked back, I've been, never been happier. Uh, I'm a vegan and I think all you guys should check out the vegan lifestyle and perhaps choose to live cruelty free.